<laughs> I would have preferred to do in regulation. Uh, we had some really good looks in the third period that we just missed on. We could have ended it in overtime. We had some really good looks, but that's hockey. And it was great to finally win a game in, in the shootout. We've lost too many, as we all know. Uh, so that was very, very important. We, we played a really good game tonight. Um, so we needed, we desperately need those points. Next, we'll go to Saad Youssef. Saad? Hey, Rick, uh, how have you seen Jason's uh, game kind of improve throughout the season in front of the net? He's a lot stronger. Uh, he's a lot more intense. Starts with that. I, I, you know, it's like typical of every young player coming into our league. You have to learn the, the strength of the players in this league and the intensity of the players in this league and the passion in which the game is played at this league. So um, it, it's not a matter of are you strong enough. It, enough. It's, it's usually a matter of cranking up your intensity for those battles. So he, he's learning that. He's staying on his feet a lot longer, a lot harder to knock off pucks. So he's figuring that all out. But um, that's where his strength is, obviously, top of the circles down around their net. And again, you're, you're playing against men. You're playing against, uh, you know, big, strong, physical, intense guys. And you got to get used to playing at that level, at that tempo. Next, we'll go to Mike Heike. Mike? Uh, Jason said that he kind of lost coverage on the second Detroit goal. Is it important to recover from that and then make positive plays after a mistake? Yeah, like, listen, that, uh, that second goal, it's like the goal Gouda scored on us last week. It bounces in off a couple of sticks. That's hockey. There's not much you can do about that. Um, but, yeah, he made a couple of reads on the four check that we'll have a we'll straighten out. Some of those goals, uh, those goals started... Not in our zone, they started in their zone. And we're just on the wrong side of guys. We'll straighten that up. Saad Yusuf, go ahead. Hey, Rick, I know, I know you've spoken about it a few times, but just what is Jamie doing that's allowing him to, you know, pop off the screen a few times uh, during the game? I, I think it, it's just skating. Um, this is the best I've seen him skate in the three years that I've been here. He's, he's, he's really skating. He's got a lot of jump in his stride. Um, the other thing he's doing that it's so he can maintain that throughout the course of the game is that he's keeping his shift short. He's not going out there for 45, 50 seconds, um, so he's able to maintain that the, the jump in his legs. But he's really skating well, and he, he, underst he understands the importance of all these games, so the level of intensity that, that he's playing with um, is very impressive, and it rubs off on the other players. He knows what's at stake here at this particular point in the season, and he's skating well, and he's battling hard, and he's making great plays, and you see his confidence around the net with the puck. He's just he's um, he's making plays. He's looking to find Dennis or Dickey and uh, or the defense, so he's hanging on to the puck. He's doing a lot of great things out there for this team. Next, we'll go to Mike Heike. Mike. <coughs> You guys have done a great job of keeping shots to a minimum this year, but Anton still had to come up with a lot of big saves, even though he only faced 22 shots. What about what about his performance today? No, he saw he was solid. He made the saves that he had to make, and I, you know, they had a couple of extra chances in the third period that I wasn't thrilled the boat that we'll we'll take a good look at. Um, it's, the goals, I mean, you're not going to do much on those goals. That second one hits, what, a couple of sticks and bounces. You, you can't do anything with that. No, he made some key saves at the right time, as we've talked about all year. Um, and so, no, his, his, his performance was very solid. Next, we'll go to Saad Yusuf. Saad? How deep do you have your shootout lineup planned, and, and uh, what goes into that as, as you get deeper into it's the not, shootout? It's not very deep. We got to go with a feeling, okay, who do we feel is up next? We, we know how we have, listen, I, I joke about that. We have four or five guys we know we're going to go to. Um, um, and then after that, it's, yeah, <laughs> it's go by feel. <laughs> 